Page 127. This is number three at the bottom of the page. I'm going to go through the process I used and let's see what we end up with. I look it over to two lines long. The clef signs are still treble and bass clef. There's two sharps in the key signature. We're either in the key of D major or B minor. We're studying major key, so you can probably guess it's in D major. If you look at the last major here, that's a D major chord. However, in my opinion, you should be doing the scales and arpeggios for both. D major and B minor. Same key signature. However, do whatever your teacher's telling you to do. A 4-4 four, four time signature. I'll take it one hand at a time and see what's going on. You recognize the notes at the beginning. It's a D major scale. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two. One, two, three, four. Now we're going back down. All we did is a D major scale going up and down. Is that cool or what? It's just put in a rhythm. That's cool. Left hand's got some chords here. D, and then a G, A, and then an F. This Remember the F sharp, that's K. Put the hands together here. Here. One, two, and here. Get the idea? So you put the hands together, I already did. Then go back over and get rid of the hesitations, I already did. And then we add the articulation. We just have phrasing for the right hand. So I'm ending the first line here, lift up, lift up, just like taking a breath. Both hands are doing it. Okay, it's the only articulation they get. Dynamics, MF is mezzo forte. It's the melody, that's the right hand. Sort of loud. These chords need to be soft. Mm -hmm. Then the speed, what's in the middle? Don't drag it. It's not moderato, no. Like you're walking someplace and you're headed there. You're not in a hurry to get there, but you're headed there. Left, right, left, right. Yeah, my moderato for now. Remember the natural accents. One, two, three, four. I recommend you let the wrist collapse a little bit on these. The idea is so you can accent any note on any finger at any time, and you can also work the wrist however you want to. It takes time to get used to that because sometimes it feels weird. You gotta get used to the weirdness so it doesn't anymore. I want you to transpose this to C major. You could put it in G major. Here, what? I don't care. I don't know, I receive, whatever. So let's play this together very slowly and check the notes and the rhythms. I'll give us four counts. One, two, ready, go.